Hi guys. So at this point, we are one week away from baby JR's making her arrival, which I hope is one week. I do want to work at least one more week. Um, I'll be 38 weeks tomorrow. So I go on maternity leave next Friday. So I hope she gives me until next Friday um, to stay in the oven and then she can come anytime after that, or actually, not even anytime. She can come anytime between Friday and um, Monday, October the 7th. I have another little bonus video for you about her arrival. So as you can see in the title, this video is basically prepping for baby, getting the bottles and everything ready. As you guys can see, I have a ton of bottles. So what I'm gonna do first and um, also somewhere over there is my breast pump stuff. So what I'm doing today is just sanitizing everything. I'm going to cook my dinner first and then I'll start working on this stuff. Because I honestly have no idea where or what I'm doing. I need to meditate on that a little bit. So um, yeah, I'm going to do that. And then I also think I'm going to use our nook right here to store her bottles but i think i'm gonna store dry bottles here because i don't know i feel like the bottles dry better when they're out in the open and then you can kind of put them up in that little enclosed space and my mind moisture holes in that so i kind of want to like see but i have way too many bottles anyway so i'm just gonna go through and get the smaller ones to start off but again like i said i'm gonna go ahead and start our dinner first and then once I finish with starting the dinner, then I'm going to jump back on here and do that. So, yeah. Because after I finished cooking, oh, got chocolate in my mouth. After I finished cooking, I started hurting. So, I'm going to wash up, take me a bath. And the next clip, I'll show y'all me getting these bottles together. Because I'm, I'm in pain. Baby girl's super duper low. And, yeah, I can't do it. Alright, guys, so I use Dapple Baby to do my baby bottle. And I'm just gonna let that water run so it's on hot. Okay, so I also have just a pot of water boiling as well. All right, guys, so because I have so many, I'm only going to do certain ones. I almost dropped it. Certain ones, like these event bottles, they are only two ounces. Don't really think I use these much. And if you want, you can, the bottles you can keep. And get new nipples. It just depends. These we didn't really use. Um, I also have these latch bottles. These are four ounces. And then I had another one, but I'm only doing the small bottles because, of course, she's not gonna drink that much when she first comes. So that's kind of what I'm about to do now. Let's put all my small bottles, wash those up. The rest of them can kind of wait. So, and I'm not gonna do many. I'm probably, <laughs> probably gonna try to do like two of each just to see which bottle she likes. Um, and these are just, you know, the little gift ones that you get in the baby grocery bags. I may not open those up just to test around on these two. Again, these are four ounces. So if I do it probably like one or two. Of them. So that's what I'm gonna do.
out of breath. But now I'm just gonna take all the bottles that I'm not gonna use and stack them back up where I had them. Or not where I had them, but like organize some kind of way. Mostly the larger ones. So I'm just gonna make sure most of them, the nipples are like older and what I may do is just take the nipples off and put them all in a zip up bag. That's what I think I'm going to end up doing. But two separate ones. Some are new and some of them are used. So I can tell that they're kind of used by the nipples. But um, I'm going to write on them and separate them that way. So now I'm just going to take on the zip up bag and write what bottle style, I shouldn't say style, bottle brand that I have in the nipple numbers. So, like this is a Dr. Brown size one nipples. Excuse my handwriting, but that's kind of what it looks like. that I don't think I have to open so I'm not I'm just gonna put it to the side since I have all this stuff same with this additional stuff I don't need it so I'm not gonna this is a more pump part and I already have some so I may I think I may wash these and those. And that's it. So apparently I missed a step, but all I did was just pour my boiling water on top of my my bottles. And that's it. And that's it. So now I'm about to get ready to take KJ to a birthday party. So thank you guys so much for watching. If the love is real, please leave a comment below. And yeah, love you guys. Chat with you later. Bye.